Mochi, how you doing, Bubby? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Boo Bash. Today's video is gonna be a couple different parts. You're gonna see me on a couple different days. I've got an assistant here. I've got Mochi who just, he's very curious of how this smells. So I just got, now full disclosure, this is September. Um, I got my fall FabFitFun box, which look how big this thing is. It is absolutely massive for right now. So I am going to be unboxing my FabFitFun, my Ipsy's, which Ipsy is now BoxyCharm and all of that. And just showing you guys all the things I picked, why I picked them, what I'm getting, all that fun stuff. Um, so that's why you guys are gonna be seeing it in a couple of different parts because different boxes sh arrive and show up on different days. And I'm just wanting to make sure that I'm unboxing these kind of more real time versus waiting. So let's unbox FabFitFun. Okay, so I've got my bub. We call him a little bub just because he kind of reminds me of a little minion sometimes. Um, and now Sushi would like to know what's going on. I've got my little supervisors just to make sure. I have cut open and let's see what's in the box. So full disclosure, I did do some add-ons for this month, uh, specifically because there are a couple things that I like to keep in stock. Um, there's a couple things I needed to stock up on, all of that. So, um, that's why th there are more things in here than typical just for that reason. Sushi, stop it. Life with kittens. All right, so the first thing, and this is one of the things that um, I did purchase, I add-ons, whatever, is the sponge gel buffer. Now, I really like these because you've got the scrubby sponge, but it has the shower gel in it. This one is the travel size one, and I actually got this so that we could take it to Italy with us. Um, we just, we like to use it. It's a lot easier for us to take something like this because then you can just throw it away. You don't have to worry about bringing shower gel and all of that, but it is just a tiny little sponge. It's not like a rough sponge, so you can use it all over your body, but it has the shower gel infused into it. You just get it wet and you can go. So we like to travel with this. The scent is blackberry and it actually smells pretty good the next thing that we got was and this is one of the things that i picked that was part of the box is KitchenAid baking sheets and a spatula the reason that i ordered and picked these is because the grocery store down here at heb has a lot of really great sides that we love to do so one of our favorite dinners that we do is we'll air fry some chicken and then we do the sides and the sides are they come in like a metal baking like a metal foil dish that's about this big um and so we currently have one cookie sheet but it's a full-sized cookie sheet and sometimes whenever i'm taking it out if i pull too hard or if i tip the angle or whatever the side will like slide around and i don't want to do that and i'm always afraid i'm going to tip the uh the dish over and like spill it all over the oven and stuff like that so whenever i saw this as one of my options i picked it just because i thought it was really really a good idea if you heard that that was just mochi knocking over another box the kittens like to play in boxes i'm just gonna say that uh but this is actually small enough that it would fit like two of the sides on it um and there's actually two baking trays I can separate. There's actually two baking trays here. So I really like that. And the spatula just came as part of it. <clears throat> Quite frankly, I think we have more than enough spatulas, but it came as a set. So it wasn't too, too bad. This second one is another thing that I um, did add on. It was another sponge out sponge. This one is Cocoa Bon. This is apparently a special limited edition collection where they all smell like. Um, baked goods this doesn't really i wouldn't say smells like anything specific it just smells sweet and it just it smells good i will say okay the next thing and truthfully i can't remember if this was an add-on or not but it was a pair of sunglasses that i just thought were absolutely adorable um 
I'm a fan of a good oversized sunglass. So let me, and I do like whenever they come, they come completely wrapped. So they're just very protected, very well protected, I should say. But they are just these like, I think they're like a tortoise shell oversized sunglass. I love a good oversized sunny. But then it comes with the case. And I'll, the one thing I like about all of the key sunglasses is when you wear them, they all come with um, a cleaning cloth. Not every sunglass set does. And I really like that this does. If you guys could see, let me see if I can pick this up and show you guys. Like, it is just packed. I don't remember ordering this much. They always send you like coupons and whatnot. Um, this. Okay, I'm not really crazy about this smell. This actually I think is like, so sometimes FabFitFun will partner with different brands and they'll throw in samples and stuff like that. This is a Dove Oat Milk and Berry Brulee cleansing bar. Uh, I'm not crazy about the smell though, to be honest. I don't know, we'll see. We shall see. All right. The next thing that I got is by Wolven, W-O-L-V-E-N. And it is actually a weighted, like it has those beans in it that you can throw into the microwave. And it is a neck and shoulder wrap. Um, I just figured it'd be a nice little thing, especially we're going into fall. It'll be nice to have, heat it up. So it is just, it is like terry cloth on one side and it is this pattern on the other. And you can just put it on your neck, heat it up, throw it in the microwave and go from there. The next thing I got is Herbivore Green Magic. It is a ceramide redness reducing serum. I, I got this because um, it was one of my picks, I should say, because sometimes when I'm in the sun too much, it's just, I get a little bit red. My skin, is very sensitive to stuff and i'm not talking about like sunburn i'm talking if if i'm out like getting the mail or something especially with texas heat and humidity sometimes i just get really flushed and really red and so i'm hoping something like this would help um the directions or i should say the description says it's a fast acting ultra soothing hydrating serum that relieves dry skin redness and visible signs of skin stress caused by dryness okay so this actually might be better when we go to pennsylvania only because Pennsylvania is really, really dry in the winter time and my skin hates it. So this might actually be really good for that. Next thing that I got is an ingrown hair oil, um, just for any time you shave, wax, anything like that. The next thing that I picked was the Color Wow Security Shampoo. Um, my hairstylist really likes the Color Wow line. So when I got saw this was an option, I was like, let's give it a shot, see what we think. If not, it'll go upstairs in the guest room for any time I have people who stay over. What is this? Hmm. I don't know what this is. It's from Stony Clover, okay. I wonder if one of my other selections was not available. So apparently it's a stony clover pouch, but it looks like it's just a tiny little, like maybe travel pouch or something like that. I don't remember picking this. So sometimes if the things that you pick or whatever are not available, they will substitute it out. Like they won't just say, sorry, you don't get one or you don't get anything, but I'm just, I'm very curious. So what it was is one of my choices see if you can focus maybe maybe not there we go one of my choices was a mystery choice and what it was is i couldn't decide what i wanted and so if you are an annual fabfitfun member you can pick all of your options and if there's anything that you're like i really don't know i wouldn't pick any of these you can do mystery so that must have been my mystery choice and then the last thing i got this for Italy. Um, I also got this just for general travel. I thought it was a really good idea, but it is a Puma cross bag. Uh, like it's a small bag, um, but it'd be enough that like 
like my water bottle, for example. Water bottle, my Yeti. Fits. And so I could carry it with me. Um, this is the 26 ounce Yeti. So I did get this, especially because, again, for Italy, I thought it would be a great idea. It's got a pouch on the strap. It's got a Oh wow, this actually goes the whole way around. Huh. So it almost looks like it would be like maybe a money pouch or something like that. Maybe a phone if you had a small phone, which I don't have a small phone. But it's got the big pouch and then it's got a smaller zip pouch. Now, whenever I saw it on the website, like on the FabFitFun website, they actually had it like this, uh, which I like because then in Italy, so anytime you travel to any major tourist place in Europe or New York or, you know, LA, Chicago, like any major city where you're gonna have a lot of tourists, you do have pickpockets. So something like this is actually going to be a really great option because if you are in an area, um, and I'm just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use Rome for an example because uh, I've been to Rome before and I remember when we went, our tour guide said that there were a lot of pickpockets around the Colosseum area. Just because it is such a high tourist area, you do tend to have a lot of that. So things like this that you keep on the front of you, you can kind of keep an arm on or hang on to your zipper or something and people can't get into it. So I got this, especially for travel or even when, um, if we're flying someplace, this is quick and easy. I can pull out my passport or pull out my wallet, things like that. And so I just got this for all of our travels. So that's my FabFitFun box for the fall. I'm actually pretty happy with everything. I love the sunglasses. I can't wait to wear those. Um, and so I will see you guys in the next transition flip over for my Ipsy. Hey everybody, new day, new box. So my Ipsy box for September just showed up. I wanna take you guys through everything that I got. Uh, full disclosure, this is the September box. I'm filming this in September simply because when I have this video scheduled to go up, we will be just getting home from Italy. Uh, so yeah, I knew I wasn't gonna get the October box in time, but I haven't even opened it. So let's open it and see what I got. Now, I will say I was really impressed with the fall FabFitFun box. I enjoyed everything. So Boxy for me, well, it used to be the Boxy Charm. It is now Ipsy. They own they own all of those brands and everything. Um, ever since it switched, I haven't been as impressed. I still have liked it because there's a couple key things that I always get and I always want. Hi, sushi. Hello, baby. Um, but the biggest thing that I miss about the old Boxy Charms is it actually used to give you a card with everything that you got in it and what its value was. Now you're given. It almost looks like a newsletter kind of a deal and you're left to guess the kind of things. But what I will do whenever I'm editing this video is I will drop with the product name and everything down below. So let's dive in. First off is a Lunar Beauty Lip Pencil. Does it have a color? The color is Doodle Blushing. So it is a dual. There are two of them in there. Let's see. Hi Mooch. Mochi man. Alright, what are you up to? What are you doing? Are you joining me? So this one is called Blushing. It is kind of like a very nude-ish. I guess it'll zoom, maybe, kind of, sort of. Nude color and then blush doodle. Doodle? Doodle is this like more mauve color. Next product is Toy Factory Oat Bay Hyaluronic Oat Milk Oil Makeup Remover. This is in plastic. Wow, okay. It's rare that we actually get a whole plastic sealed situation going on. So just a bottle. We'll see. I'm hit very hit or miss with makeup removers. It kind of all depends. Um, one thing with the Ipsy subscription is if you have like an annual subscription or something, you can usually pick products. I forgot to pick, so all of these are surprises. Next one is the Ren Clean Skincare Ever Hydrate Marine Moisture Replenish Cream. Um, I had their, I think it was like 
a vitamin C cream. I actually really liked it. So this was interesting. Just another little pump bottle. I don't know why it doesn't like to zoom. It stays on me, but it doesn't want to zoom. The next thing I got was the Dermalect Cosmeceuticals Rapid Repair Barrier Balancing Serum. Oh, that's interesting. Hydrating serum boosts the skin's moisture balance, absorbency, and tone. That's interesting. And that's a teeny tiny little bottle for that big old box. I'm always amazed at how stuff gets packaged and everything. And then last one is People's Beauty Frontliner Mask and Scrub. Soothe and exfoliate with tri-molecular hyaluronic acid, triple plant moisture complex, and kaolin. Interesting. Now, every quarter, they do what's called the Icon Box. Um, lately, it's been curated by celebrities. I haven't been crazy about that, but I love the fact that some of my favorite products, like the Grown Alchemist brand, Kate Somerville, things like that, I can get those products included. Um, so this is a mask and scrub. Interesting. Huh. Spread over your face, leave on for 10 minutes, then massage into skin and rinse. Can be used up to twice a week. Now, this will be very interesting considering I am hypersensitive. So this was the five products. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. That I got in this month. Um, I will, like I said, as things are listing, I will list it all out. I will also put it in the description box below. All right, guys. So totally separate day, but my October box came. So I wanted to open it and share with you guys and explore everything that's in my October boxy ipsy with you guys. So first thing is they have the little magazine catalog thing that they usually do. And then I've got a bunch of stuff. So the first thing is this uh, Tubigan Green Glow Up Cream. Um, it is vegan. What is it? Looks like maybe a cream, a moisturizer kind of a thing. Let's open and see what it is. Okay, yeah, so it looks like it is a moisturizer. It smells pretty good, and I just stuck my nose in it. Do you guys ever do that when you go to, like, smell something or whatever, and you stick your face in it, and you're like, ah. Yeah, that's me. Next thing I got is a Tarte blush. Uh, the blush tape, I really like this. This is in the shade pink. Um, this is actually the shade that I like to use, and so when I saw this as an option, I actually picked that option just because I knew that it would be good. The next thing is a Frank Body Smoothing AHA Body Lotion with lactic and glycolic acids that help to exfoliate and hydrate at the same time. Um, especially if we're getting into chillier time in Texas. I know, it's in the 70s. It's cold. And so I got that. The next thing I got is a Keep It Clean Hydrating Gel Cleanser. Um, I'm always on the hunt for a good cleanser that is pH balancing, is easy on my face, things like that, so I'm going to give this a shot. If this doesn't work, Greg will use it, which is kind of a nice little thing. And then there's a little palette of sorts. Alrighty. So it's Adorata. Um... I have no idea what that is saying. I, for whatever reason, my brain is not registering the print, but it's an On Your Face Contour and Color Trio. That's cool. Oh, I like the packaging. It's kind of like uh, old school tattoos. Like, it kind of makes me think of, um, like, oh my gosh, what were those shoes that I used to wear? Ed Hardy's? Yeah, Ed Hardy, because Tom Hardy's the actor, Ed Hardy's. Um, but it is a blush, it is a blush bronzer and palette trio. That's interesting. I'll be, and this looks like my coloring too. All right, so that is my October box. So you've seen the FabFitFun, September box, and October box. Lots of unboxings. Uh, thank you so much for following along on this video, guys, and I'll see you all tomorrow.